I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Hello, my little rose petals. It is uh, Wednesday here on Diva and the Diamonds, and I think that I don't even need to say what that means. It means it's time to get, say it with me, melted! Melted! Ooh, that did not do wonders for the hair. It is Disney week here on Diva and the Diamonds, and let's be real, we all love Disney. Cheers. I feel like I just, well, obviously I grew up on Disney, but I just feel like I am a child of Disney, that I could potentially have been birthed by Minnie. You know, it's just like, I just love Disney so much. And so this week I found a questionnaire on Disney movies, and I thought that I would answer some of the questions here. So, let's do it, I guess. I don't know. By the way, that says Nala. It's upside down, but it says Nala um, because I named my dog Nala. May she rest in peace. My favorite Disney movie is The Little Mermaid. Ugh, I just love Ariel. She is queen of everything, and I love her. Well, this is kind of a silly question since I already answered it, but I love Ariel, and I love Jasmine, and I love Milan, and I just, I am working with my special Rosie Rose, and uh, we are working, I'm gonna have her make a tattoo for me of those three girls, and I'm gonna get it on my body. My favorite hero in a Disney movie is probably the unsung hero of The Lion King, which is Rafiki. He helps Simba realize his potential and what he needs to do. Rafiki helped save Pride Rock. I love Dory. I just think that... I just, I love Dory, and I think that she is probably the greatest sidekick in any movie. I think that some of the most evil people are Ursula, scary. Scar, scary. Maleficent, scary. I ain't down. How do I just choose one couple? I love Ariel and Eric, Aladdin and Jasmine, Belle and the Beast. I just... Uh, Nala and Simba, I love them all. I just, I cannot choose. So I will just say, I love all the couples in all of the Disney movies. If you did not just melt when Belle dances with the Beast in that yellow dress, and he's in his little suit coat, I just, I don't even know what's wrong with you, because that dancing scene melts me every time. Ooh, favorite kiss, how racy. But if I had to choose my favorite kiss, I would definitely choose Eric and Ariel because again, we waited that entire movie. We had a song dedicated to them kissing, you know, kiss that girl. Oh, whoa, whoa, sha na 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 na. You know, I just, I love it. You know, I really love the ending of Milan because she goes home to her family and they're so proud of her and her and her grandma. I just, it is such a sweet moment. It is probably one of my favorite endings in a Disney movie because I think that it's precious and sweet and it's about family and I love it. I was emotionally enraged when... Ursula takes human form, and she just, oh, it just makes me so mad. Every time, I just, like, I feel for Ariel. But if the emotional question is really about what made me so sad, Mufasa dying is just, I mean, that is so awful. When Mufasa dies, I cry. 
My favorite Disney child? Oh, God. I would probably say Nala because, again, I just... My dog was named Nala. I loved Nala. I think that Nala is so pretty and she's funny. And her and Simba together as children, they were causing problems, but I loved them anyway. Yeah, I think that's who I would end up going with if I had to choose my favorite child. Either Nala or I even... I mean, everyone loves Nemo. Everyone loves Nemo. Everyone hates the Finding Nemo ride at Disneyland. If I had to choose my favorite animal, I just, this question made me so happy. Because if I had to choose my favorite Disney animal, it would be Raja. Because, I mean, how, like, you are super fabulous if you have a huge tiger that loves you and just wants to cuddle with you and will not attack you. I love Raja. I love Jasmine and Raja together. Oh, I want a Raja so bad. Oh, I just get so tingly when I just think about Raja. I love him. Oh my God. If I had to choose my absolute favorite songs, one part of your world. Look at this stuff. Isn't it neat? Wouldn't you think my collection's complete? And I would also choose a whole new world because... I just love it. Unbelievable sights, indescribable feelings, soaring, tumbling, freewheeling through an endless diamond sky. Okay, so you guys are probably gonna think I'm really sick, but one of the like most beautiful, like visually stunning pieces of Disney work. This is so sick, because it should not be beautiful, but it is so beautiful. It is when Ursula takes Ariel's voice, and Ariel, like, you know, she's doing the... You know, and she loses her voice. The, like, colors, the way that, like, her, like, face gets colored, and then she... And she, like, it's, like, orange, and, ugh, ah, I love that scene. I think it's gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And I also think that at the end, when Ursula is, like, in the ocean, and she's got King Triton's trident, and she's, like, stirring the sea, and it's, like, blue, and I just, oh, my God, that movie is so visually beautiful. Everything about that movie is beautiful, but... Like, those two parts, I mean, I don't care how evil they are. They are stunning. My favorite Disney ending is something that I already answered. It's Milan because she ends up with her family, and her family is so proud. She saved a country. And you know what? She didn't need a man. That's, that's why I love it. All right, those were the questions on the Disney questionnaire. I will go ahead and put a link to that in the description because I thought it was really fun to answer. And my question for you, the viewers, would be, what is your favorite Disney channel movie? Uh, leave it in the comments, and I will see you next week. I love you all, and stick around tomorrow because I believe that Rose is back! Bye, baby!